Potter's Pond for the 31st of May. A extraordinarily strong worm hatch tonight is bringing up thousands and thousands of bass. No matter where you look in this pond, you see rising fish. Unbelievable night. As far as you can look down the lake and the pond, uh, you can't probably see it in this video, but as far as I can see, I see rising fish. And there are a million worms in here. You talk about competition. Good God. There are million. There's got to be millions of worms in this pond. And this is the spring where Ninigrit never turned on, but Potter's Pond, where we're at right now, is just alive with fish. And there's some nice ones in here. I caught earlier a 30, was it 31 or 30 inch fish? 30, don't know. 30. And uh, a number of uh, mid 20s. And if you, I'll just be quiet here and maybe you can hear the splashes these fish are making. Let's just be quiet for a minute. Come to Rhode Island in the spring fish with skinny water charters for the worm hatch. Closest thing anybody will have to dry fly fishing in salt water. This is wonderful. And if you're not a fly fisherman, the old spinning rod and bobber and sluggo technique works pretty good. Wonderful night. Yeah, there's a lot of seaweed in the water, which means that for flies and for sluggos, practically every retrieve has got to have weed on it, and these fish will not touch it if it has any weed attached to the hook. All right, so anyway, we're out of here. Uh, at least with the at least with the video, uh, we're we're done here. I want to save a little bit of battery power for the next big fish. Over and out. Skinny water charters. Ri. Dot com.